Hi, I'm Nick Schott, Senior Solution Engineer at Postman. I'm an API practitioner helping organizations increase productivity, quality, and governance for their API programs. My background is in software engineering and enterprise architecture, and I've helped customers in many industries, including insurance and insure tech. What we're seeing in the insurance industry is increasing regulatory pressures, a lack of standards, and increased uh, demand from customers and higher expectations. But what if instead of these challenges that you and your peers are facing, you could have a policyholder 360 view rather than an unconsolidated view? What if you could take legacy systems and modernize them into microservices? And what if you could embrace standards rather than closed formats and use API networks to increase agility and speed. With Postman, you can achieve this. Let's see how. Our use case will focus on a Mobile Claims 360 UX API that we're going to deliver by orchestrating and enriching data with existing open insurance APIs, know your customer ID verification APIs, pay as your drive APIs, and claims APIs, which in fact are modernizing legacy claims systems. So the first piece we're going to look at is the pay as you drive API. When we launch Postman, you'll notice that there's a lot here uh, in terms of collaboration, including workspaces for my team, as well as recent changes made to uh, Postman collections and APIs. To reuse the pay as you drive API, we're going to look at the bring your own car collection that's provided in the public API network by Mercedes-Benz. The Bring Your Own Car API gives us a lot of functionality for things like vehicle status, odometer tracking, uh, uh, door status. And using this, we can pick up a lot in terms of the driving habits of our customers. Uh, one key thing is it was very straightforward for me to find this API in the public API network, come in, see documentation about what this does, and the restful resources and verbs that are here, as well as the ability to even generate, for instance, stub code to invoke this uh, API. So you can see here how quickly somebody could get from discovering an API to making their first API call and even validating against a sample response. Next in our use case, we'll check out the Open Insurance API and how that can help us. The Open Insurance API is an API that we have in our API network. Um, so in addition to the public and partner API networks, we have a private API network where I can browse APIs by line of business. For instance, different types of insurance, property and casualty, reinsurance, and so on or just search for keywords like Open Insurance API. And this will show me all the different versions of my Open Insurance API, give me the ability to go right into a workspace and work with them. Or again, see the documentation and definition behind these. So if I'm not familiar with Open Insurance, this can very quickly tell me how I can work with Open Insurance and post a claim. So very straightforward to discover APIs from both the public API network, such as the pay as you drive API, as well as the private API network like the Open Insurance API. Now let's see how Postman can help with testing to ensure that API behavior is consistent with expectations. On our legacy claims system API, which we're going to use for this mobile claims UX, where we can upload a picture of an accident and submit a claim, we want to ensure that what's coming back when we get an account detail is consistent with our API contract. And this is where you can see our test results say the status code was 200, our uh, claim comments were populated as expected, and our schema is valid. You can in fact call this from scheduled monitors as well as from your automated CICD process. We're gonna take that legacy claim system API and uh, modernize it as a mobile claims API. This is where we want to be able to uh, post information about a uh, vehicle um, accident 
So for instance, create a claim and noticing here that my type is auto, I may want my enterprise architect to switch this to uh, not the word auto, but vehicle, for example. And this will tag my enterprise architect and guide them in here to make the appropriate change, um, at which point they can mark it as resolved, as well as submit a uh, pull request on the uh, collection that they forked if they're doing a git like workflow and then I can merge that into uh, my baseline code. And one example of that is here where we're doing a merge of detail about uh, adding uh, international support to the ID verification API and I've got an audit trail of what's been changed by my enterprise architect. Now we'll stick with the claims API. That's an example of how we can help with uh, testing as well as uh, delivering merges and pull requests and things like that. Next, we're going to look at how the claims API can give us uh, the rest of the functionality we need on this use case, as well as some nice visualizations. So my claims API lets me uh, do a post to add an image to a claim. This is where I could say, I want to upload a given um, JPEG and have that added to a claim. And then I can say, you know what? I want to get everything associated with that claim. And this is where we take the JSON values that are returned by an API call and we can actually visualize them. We can actually say, let's format this and show that the assigned agent uh, was Elaine Bennis. And here's a picture of the front passenger side bumper. Um, and there's all different things that you can do with the visualization functionality. For instance, have a filterable list of, in our case, claims where we want to say we want to just deal with auto claims. So that's how Postman can help us with productivity, quality, and governance to address the challenges we see in the insurance space, such as lack of standards, increasing regulatory pressures, and modernizing legacy systems. Hence, we were able to deliver our Mobile Claims 360 UX API with uh, high productivity, consistent quality, and airtight governance. Please visit postman.com to learn more. Thank you.